Well, happy Tuesday. Happy March 1st, everybody. Happy Scorpio. Happy Scorpio Day. Um, actually, it's my one year anniversary. I've been doing this. So yeah, I'm just kind of bubbly, very chipper today. Happy to see you guys. I'm starting my Zodiac on Tuesday this week. Um, but so do share Scorpio. How have you been? You're amongst friends. Give us the CD details. All right, Scorpios, this is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Oh, and before I get into my whole thing, um, bonus reads. Are, I am doing them this weekend on Sunday. Top three viewed highest signs. You have been a bonus read. You may have seen it. It's just intended to feel like a personal story. And also, if you haven't yet, feel free to like and subscribe, but only if you're feeling my vibe. Nothing mandatory around this joint, Scorpio. Nothing mandatory. I'm just glad to see you guys. All right, let's get into your story. I am using... I want to say it's called Dream Keepers Tarot deck for the main deck, and I'm using the Art of the Golden Nouveau Tarot. But here's the here's the interesting thing. I noticed a Seven of Pentacles reversed on the main deck, but a Seven of Pentacles upright on the clarifying deck. Is that not two separate energies? You stopped waiting on somebody, maybe? Waste of time, threw up, Wheel of Fortune reverse. Yeah, and you had no choice but to start over. I feel like your electricity was fading in that current situation stuck for a long time waiting on something but what is this going on we have a seven of pentacles we have oh there you are seven of cups page of cups reverse <laughs> you got somebody confused are you not speaking to somebody and they're over here waiting waiting for scorpio what's scorpio doing what is scorpio what is scorpio doing these days they're not contacting me and and delivering their energy like they once used to all right, Scorpio, let's see what's going on. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Scorpio. Let's do this, guys. If you are Scorpio, no Scorpio, feel like do, doing a Scorpio? <laughs> it's not Tarot After Dark, Stacy. Too early, too early, too soon. Some of you might be doing that. I don't know. Okay. I don't want to know what some of you guys are doing. I swear to God, some, a card just went flying and I must look. Ooh, the moon reverse. I like that. The moon reverse to me is very similar to a Seven of Cups, your card reverse clarity enlightening uh it's just where you once may have been confused in a situation you are so and now enlightened feeling good too all right general energy for my scorpios i know you guys are like what did she put cracking her tea today what who is this lady all right general energy for my scorpios general energy for my scorpios general energy for my scorpios what's going on it is eight of pentacles i like that could be working on yourself just working 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 good card virgo energy that's where your focus is what's influencing the eight of pentacles something's working in your life what's what's influencing this what's influencing this it is ooh, powerful the creatrix in this deck this is the magician but unlike the magician, I mean, the magician is supposed to be, but this just goes uh, more in depth on what it should be. It's about creating your life. It's not about things just happening. That's, that's, that's uh, manifesting subconscious, you know, like sub, you know, subconsciously. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, it's, this is about consciously creating the life you want and you are now working towards it. That's what I see. I think you're really focused on work guys and your money. What's the reason for the reading? Why are we all here today, Scorpios? What is it? What's the reason? What's the reason? Three of Cups reverse. I feel like that's who's waiting for you over there. Had to give something up. Maybe there was other energies you found out, but most importantly, it's disloyal energies. Could be within love, family, work. It's just kind of, just somebody who you thought had your back, Scorpio. They didn't. They really didn't. They could have been talking behind your back. They could have been playing around behind your back. Okay, what is in the past? And that's Cancerian. What's in the past? What's in the past for you guys? What's in the past? Seven, of, oh, who did you catch? Whose boots have your bed been? Whose bed have your boots been under? The Shania Toy song I got. Seven of Swords Reverse. That's when you find something out about this disloyal energy and you had no choice but to move on. Sometimes, you know what? Painful lessons are really good because it releases you from something that really, you may not have even been happy in that situation. This is where I think you're happy. Finding security on yourself, in yourself, within yourself, um, working. I don't know. I just feel like you're in a good place. What's on your mind? What is on Scorpio's mind? Okay, death card. There you are. Did you see how that card gently came out of the deck? It picked itself. There you are, death card. It's a beautiful card. That would be a great painting. 
um, to have on the wall. But yeah, the death card, complete transformation. You were, once you found out who you were really dealing with, yep, that released you and allowed you to grow. And it, it almost, you, I just feel like you waited on someone to either grow up or to choose you or to leave someone else for you, which is choosing you. But whatever it was, you realize you wasted your time. What's in the near future? What's in the near future, my Scorpios? What's in the near future? What's in the near future? There it is, two of them. Oh, we have the Tower and the Ten of Pentacles Reverse. The Tower is your card, which looks very much like the Death card. The Tower is a sudden change. Why do I feel like somebody owes you money? That's what I'm looking at that. There it is. Seven of Cups reverse and Nine of Pentacles reverse. Oh, ah. and then the lover. Some of you, I actually feel like whoever you were with, maybe you found out they were stealing from you. This Nine of Pentacles reverse, Seven of Cups getting really clear why something's, maybe something was missing. I, either clear on why you're drained or a certain situation is draining you, which is also maybe, but you kept staying in it. But I do feel like this Three of Cups reverse is what released you because you found out it wasn't only that, you know, they had bad behavior or, or maybe they were narcissistic or maybe they treated you terribly, but you still stayed. But it wasn't until you probably found a third energy involved is what released you. But something with this nine and 10 of pentacles reverse makes me feel with the lovers here and 10 of cups reverse. It just makes me feel like, God, I really hope some of you, they didn't take from you like money as that that could that i don't think that's the the big storyline here but that sure feels like it's somebody's storyline but we do have somebody look at that seven of pentacles they're waiting for you to come back seven of cups you they're not you're not talking to them five of pentacles reverse six of cups reverse i actually think you're doing so much better without them yeah there's the sun card i really do i think you're doing so much better without them okay let's clarify what is going on here what is this? Eight of Pentacles and the Creatrix, which is the magician influenced by. And really, I think this motivated you guys to make up for lost time. That's what I'm getting with that. Seven of Pentacles reverse. And then we have the magician and the Eight of Pentacles. I feel like you could have wasted five years in a situation, five months, even if it's five minutes. This Scorpio is trying to make up for all the time they lost. And I feel like this is so amplified of you're just really throwing yourself into work, into growing into yourself too. Might be working out, eating better. You're just determined to do, to get better next time around and to do better. What is this Eight of Pentacles and the Creatrix? The Eight of Pentacles influenced by the Magician. The Eight of Pentacles influenced by the Magician for my Scorpios. The Eight of Pentacles influenced by the Magician. There it is. It is a eight, eight of pentacles reverse. It wasn't, it just wasn't working. I feel like you, you feel like you wasted your time and you could have lost money because man, because there we have the 10 of pentacles reverse. This person could have been spending a lot of your money. What is this? And maybe you're trying to uh, build back your savings account. What is that? And five of pentacles. Yeah, I just feel like some of you really lost some money in this situation. And they and then it's like you you would give them. You were the one who had to overdo it. Maybe the birthdays you overdid it, and then what you got back was like, here's a pencil, Scorpio. You know you always wanted this pencil. And and whatever you did, you you just didn't get back. But and then you're out here. But this is the same type of person that would overdo it with their friends or family or someone else. Okay, what is this Three of Cups Reverse? Reason for the reading. What is the Three of Cups Reverse? Cancerian Energy, the reason for the reading. I'm sorry, that's Taurus and Virgo. Three of Cups Reverse. Page of Cups. I feel like this is an apology. I, they're try, Three of Cups Reverse, reason for the reading. You dumped out their cup and they're just like scrounging on the ground, picking this cup up and like, here, here's your cup back, but you know what? They still want you to fill it. They even give you a fish, but with no water. They, it's, they probably still want you to fill their cup. They're like, here, where have you been? I, I'm, I'm completely depleted over here. Okay, what is the Seven of Swords reverse in the past? 
Aquarian energy. Seven of Swords reversed in the past. Seven of Swords reversed in the past. And then Nine of Cups. Yeah. Ooh. You know, I'm telling you. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but this is a smooth operator. Seven of Swords reversed. What you found out with this Three of Cups reverse and the Seven of Cups reverse that you were holding on, Four of Cups, like you're waiting for, okay, think of a Four of Cups. You are waiting for this person's cup, okay? But they had a lot of cups to give. You know why? Because they've been dealing with people who kept giving them their cups over here, Three of Cups reverse. But if you take, yeah, but with this, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm all over the place. I'm all over the place. I mean, no matter how you subtract it, it's either a Two of Cups reverse or it's a four of cups upright, or then we have, if you take a nine minus the three, it's a six of cups, which is would be a, um, a soul connection. But where I was getting with this, I'm sorry, the numbers got lost on me here. So where I was getting with this, with this nine of cups is this person is, this is type of a smug energy. I actually feel with this seven of swords reverse, what they, what they portray maybe to you, how they got you, but to other people is that they really have it going on. I feel like what he's trying to portray is he's a king of cups, king of wands, king of pentacles. This is somebody who, who probably wears really nice clothes, but you may have bought them, you know, who really drives a nice car, but it's your car. And then they go and pick up other people with it. Or they take your money and spend it on other people. I mean, this is like a smooth, look at that page of swords and the emperor. I feel like you found something out. And the emperor is just like, oh, no, no, no. There it is, seven of swords again, what this person has been getting away with. Yeah, I really feel like something went down recently here. What is the death card on Scorpio's mind? Upright, strong, we are so done with this. You are out of here. No second chances. Tell me about the death card. Well, four of wands, justice reverse. There is four of cups reverse, nine of pentacles reverse. Yeah, this is what you're letting go of. Nine of cups. I feel like you were drained waiting around for this cup, waiting for the, for them to notice you, to to for you to be their only one. And you may have gotten inclination that they were messing around. Justice reversed in the four of, four of wands. And for some of you, this person was, maybe you were waiting for them to leave their spouse or leave their long-term partner for you. But then you realize there's other people involved. Because I think this is what you were trying to get, the four of wands, but in waiting for them to end something. Because remember, I got a lot of waiting here and you feel like you wasted your time waiting on someone in a situation which really it caused you to miss opportunities keeping you stuck six of swords reverse and empress reverse the stuck energy kept you from growing elsewhere which is probably what they want because they don't want you given to anybody else but them but yet they're over here on a page of pentacles reverse not giving you anything yeah, and judgments here is it's over aces and then an ace of swords reverse okay tell me about this ten of pentacles reverse in the tower bringing in that tower Scorpio is taking their power back and bringing in that tower. What is the tower and the Ten of Pentacles reverse? Tower and the Ten of Pentacles reverse. I think you're dropping the hammer on them. Yeah, Page of Swords. This is when you find something out and it's not good. Bad news card, Page of Swords reverse. What you found out is the Three of Cups reverse. They've been getting away with this Seven of Swords reverse that they had it to give and they weren't giving it to you. They left you waiting. They left you not feeling like you, you know, made you kind of feel crappy because it was kind of like, why aren't they picking me? Why aren't they calling me? Well, you find out they're, they've been having their hands full, literally, with a bunch of different things and people. Okay, what is this? Ten of Pentacles reverse, the tower and the page of swords reverse. Man, Scorpio is bringing it down. And to start over, page of wands, all on your own. High self-esteem there. You're just like, nope, I am not dealing with this in the Five of Cups, but I do feel like they're back here because they got caught. They're like, man, where's that Scorpio? See, I felt that here with this Page of Cups, but you see how he's staring at the five, and that's your card, by the way, because I think they're missing you. But you see how they're looking at that cup on the ground and then they pick the cup up, but it's empty. <laughs> and there was some fish, poor fish got caught in it. They're like, Scorpio, come back here. Here's your cup. And by the way, while you're over there, can you fill it for me? Yeah, that's... Nah, just keep going, Scorpio. Page of Wands, Wheel of Fortune. It's time to, to 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 move it along. Six of Pentacles. I just feel like this is you focused on your work. Ten of Wands is working a lot on that money. I really feel that that's what that is. And leaving whatever this is behind. Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, Reverse. 
it's it's really a gift i um, in for some of you that are just about ready to go through this or who are going through this and it's really a gift because you really don't want somebody who you thought you can trust and you can't trust what if you married someone like this i mean you, you you, it's just so disloyal. So it's really a gift to know who they are so you can find who you really should be with. All right, my Scorpios, that is what I have for you this week. I hope you have a great rest of your week and I'll see you next week, guys. Happy March. Take care.